Have you ever wished God would speak to you directly, offering guidance, comfort, or direction? The good news is, He does. God speaks to us in many ways, and one of the most powerful is through prophecy. Prophecy is like a personal message from the heart of God, tailored just for you. It's His way of revealing His plans, His love, and His purpose for your life. It's a message of hope, encouragement, and sometimes even correction, designed to draw you closer to Him. Throughout history, God has used prophets to communicate His will and direct His people. Think of Noah, warned of the flood and instructed to build an ark. Consider Moses, receiving the Ten Commandments and leading the Israelites to freedom. These prophetic encounters shaped history and transformed lives. Today, God is still speaking. He's still pouring out His Spirit, and He still desires to communicate with His children. Are you ready to listen? Prophecy is simply God speaking, revealing His heart and His will. It's a supernatural message, delivered through human vessels carrying divine authority and power. In the Bible, we see many examples of prophecy. Isaiah, filled with the Spirit of God, spoke of a coming Messiah who would bear our griefs and carry our sorrows. Jeremiah, known as the weeping prophet, warned of judgment and called the people to repentance. Ezekiel, in a vision of dry bones, prophesied about the restoration and resurrection of God's people. These prophets didn't just predict the future, although sometimes they did. They spoke God's truth into their current situations, addressing sin, offering hope, and revealing God's unwavering love. They were God's mouthpiece, proclaiming His message with boldness and clarity. God's prophetic word is multifaceted, serving many purposes in our lives. First, prophecy reveals God's will. It provides direction, guidance, and clarity for our journey. When we feel lost or uncertain, prophecy can be like a compass, pointing us back to God's perfect plan. Second, prophecy calls us to repentance. It shines a light on areas where we've strayed from God's path and invites us to turn back to Him. It's a loving rebuke, designed to correct and restore us to right relationship with our Creator. Third, prophecy provides direction. It speaks into our decisions, our relationships, and our purpose, offering wisdom and guidance for navigating life's complexities. It's like having a divine roadmap, helping us make choices that align with God's best for our lives. Finally, prophecy offers comfort and encouragement. In times of difficulty or despair, God's prophetic word can be a lifeline, reminding us of His presence, His faithfulness, and His unwavering love. It speaks peace to our storms, assuring us that we are never alone. As we explore the prophetic, it's vital to approach it with discernment and wisdom. Not every voice that claims to speak for God is truly from Him. First, always compare what you hear with Scripture. The Bible is our ultimate authority, and any prophetic word must align with its teachings. If a message contradicts Scripture, reject it. Second, pray for discernment. Ask the Holy Spirit to guide your understanding and to help you recognize God's voice. He is faithful to lead you into all truth. Third, consult with mature believers. Seek guidance from pastors, mentors, or spiritual leaders you trust. They can offer valuable insights and help you weigh the validity of a prophetic word. Remember, prophecy is a gift, not a toy. It's a sacred responsibility to handle it with care, reverence, and humility. Section 5, Prophecy Today, A Living Word for a Changing World. You might be wondering, is prophecy still relevant today? Absolutely. The same God who spoke through prophets in the past is still speaking today. He is still pouring out His Spirit on all flesh, just as He promised in Acts 2, verse 17. In a world filled with uncertainty and change, we need God's guidance more than ever. We need His direction, His comfort and His wisdom to navigate the complexities of life. Prophecy provides that for us. It reminds us that we are not alone, that God is in control, and that He has a plan for our lives. It offers hope for the future, encouragement for the present, and a deeper understanding of God's heart. Just as God used prophets to shape history, He is still using prophetic voices today to impact individuals, churches, and even nations. The prophetic is not a relic of the past, it's a living, breathing reality that is transforming lives in the present. Section 6. 
growing through prophecy, personal transformation and guidance. Think of prophecy as a catalyst for personal growth. It's like fertilizer for our souls, helping us flourish and grow in our relationship with God. When we receive a prophetic word that resonates with our spirit, it can ignite a fire within us. It can stir up our faith, challenge our perspectives, and motivate us to pursue God's plan for our lives with renewed passion. Prophecy can also provide specific guidance for our lives. It might reveal a new career path, a ministry opportunity, or even a future spouse. It can offer wisdom for our finances, our health, or our relationships. The key is to approach prophecy with an open heart and a willingness to obey. When we align our lives with God's prophetic word, we position ourselves for his blessings, his favor, and his supernatural intervention. Section 7. The Prophetic Community. Sharing the journey together. As we explore the prophetic, it's important to remember that we're not on this journey alone. God has placed us in a community of believers where we can share our experiences, encourage one another, and grow together. Find a church or a group of friends who value the prophetic and who approach it with wisdom and discernment. Share your experiences, ask questions, and learn from one another. Iron sharpens iron, and in the same way we can sharpen one another's understanding of the prophetic as we journey together. We can pray for each other, encourage one another's gifts, and help each other stay grounded in truth. Remember, the prophetic is not meant to be a source of division or elitism. It's a gift that God has given to the church to build us up, unify us, and empower us to fulfill his mission. Section 8. The Dangers of Misinterpretation. Staying Grounded in Truth. While prophecy is a powerful gift, it's essential to acknowledge the potential for misinterpretation. Not every word that claims to be prophetic is truly from God. Some individuals may misinterpret their own thoughts or desires as God's voice. Others may be motivated by selfish ambition or a desire for attention. Still, others may be deceived by false spirits or counterfeit gifts. That's why discernment is so crucial. We must test every spirit, as 1 John 4, 1 instructs, to determine whether it's from God. We must be grounded in Scripture, led by the Holy Spirit, and accountable to wise counsel. If we encounter a prophetic word that seems off, contradicts Scripture, or promotes division or strife, we must reject it. Our loyalty is to God and His Word above all else. Section 9. Embracing the Prophetic Stepping into God's plan. Embracing the prophetic requires faith, courage, and a willingness to step outside of our comfort zones. It means trusting God's voice, even when it challenges our understanding or disrupts our plans. When we encounter a prophetic word that resonates with our spirit and aligns with scripture, we should receive it with an open heart and a yielded will. We should ask God to help us understand its meaning and to give us the grace to walk it out in our lives. This might require us to make changes, to step out in faith, or to trust God in new and unfamiliar ways. But as we surrender to his leading, we position ourselves to experience the fullness of his plan and purpose for our lives. Remember, the prophetic is not about predicting the future. It's about partnering with God to create a better future. It's about aligning our lives with his will and allowing him to work through us to accomplish his purposes on earth. Section 10. A future filled with hope, living in the light of prophecy. When we embrace God's prophetic word, we step into a future filled with hope, purpose and possibility. We begin to see our lives through the lens of God's promises and to live with an expectancy that he is working all things together for our good. We are reminded that we are not defined by our past mistakes, our current circumstances, or the limitations of our own understanding. We are defined by God's love, God's power, and God's limitless potential working within us. So, let's open our hearts to the prophetic word. Let's cultivate a lifestyle of listening to God's voice, discerning his will, and obeying his leading. And let's watch in amazement as he unfolds his extraordinary plan for our lives, one prophetic word at a time.